Hello, Taurus. It's Milady, and this is Milady's Way Tarot. And I'm coming to do your weekly express, nope, weekly straight to the point reading for the week of, in the week of, for 11, 2017. 2017. 2023. The cards I'm using today are. Okay, Wisdom of the House of Night by PC Cast. And I'm closing off with my um, Fortune Reading Cards by Sharina Star. One card from there. I want to thank everybody for like, sharing, subscribing, setting up personal readings, commenting, and hitting that notification bell. All right, more foes. Let's get this show on the road. All right, what's going on with the Taurus? Taurus, Taurus, Taurus. What's going on? What's going on? What's going on? All right. So we got the conclusion card here. So I do feel like, sorry, my baby's hair is all over the place. Um, so I do feel like some kind of ending of a story, something is getting ready to be over, okay? Um, something is coming to an end. It could be just the year because it's almost over. All right, so we got the love card reversed here. So I do feel like somebody is separating when it comes to love. Um, somebody is starting to, uh, not to love someone um, or realizing that they're not getting the love that they deserve, okay? Mm-hmm. All right, those jump right on out. All right, so we got the deceit card here. So I do feel like somebody could be dealing with somebody that was loving someone on the outside of a relationship um, or somebody still in love with their ex, okay? Oh, high priestess of fire. Goodness. All right, so I do feel like somebody... Um, I'm going to tell you what I'm hearing and seeing. Somebody been talking about they ex or talking about grown-up time with they ex. Uh, I feel like I might have heard or seen somebody's text message talking about grown-up stuff with they ex. Okay, but I do feel like somebody is still um, attracted to their ex um, in a grown-up way. Okay. All right, so we got the risk card here. Oh, goodness. All right, so it looked like somebody lied in the first place. This person came out the gate lying, okay? So it's like this person was already lying in the first place. I gave this person a chance, and now this person is still, like, fantasizing and talking about their ex, okay? So it's like I thought it was going to be a little thing or a little problem, but it is not, okay? This person is not getting over it. They ain't getting over this ex. All right, so we got the high priestess of spirit here. So I do feel like I'm having dreams. I'm having feelings. Um, I do feel like my ancestors, spirit angels, spirit guides, you know, higher beings, you know, are coming to tell me and talk to me and help me realize that this person isn't good. Um, or this person won't be good for the people who just starting this, okay? Um, but I do feel like somebody's getting a lot of signs about this. And I feel like I'm just moving forward, okay? But yeah, this person walked in the door line, okay? Oh, they said read it, so that's what I'm going to do. So we got the high priestess of water here. So I do feel like somebody got some changes going on. I feel like mentally, emotionally, and physically, okay? I feel like somebody may be having some eating issues right now due to the stress of this person that they fell in love with that's still connected to that previous person. Yep. So we got the lust card here. So I do feel like the, some grown-up activity has happened out there on the outside with the ex, okay? Obedience is not in this person, okay? This person wasn't good to that last one, and this person is not good now, okay? So we got forbidden card reverse. So I do feel like this person don't care about no labels, no names, no papers, no nothing. When they want to do something, they're going to do it. So I feel like somebody 
came and, and moved in or married or and got engaged to somebody else, but they still want the ex and they still getting it, okay? All right, so we got the honesty card here. So this makes me feel like when you call this person out or when arguments happen, I do feel like this person tell, tells the truth, but I feel like they retract it. They take it back, okay? Mm. So we got the denial card reversed here. So I do feel like some stuff is getting ready to happen and the denial will not be there, okay? Um, and it's also telling me that this honesty card is for you, okay? So it's thinking about the dates, thinking about the times, think about the things that happened, the things that were said, things were, were done, things you did, things did to you. So it's basically telling you, you need to just sit back and really think about the whole, ooh, this just made my chest hurt and it made a lot of anger pop out. Uh, just sit back and think about what has happened to you um, so you can realize what's going on, okay? So I feel like somebody want to be there, don't want to be there, uh, but I do feel like that somebody is coming out of denial as well, okay? I'm coming out of denial. All right, so we're going to read one of these cards from Sharina Star. One card from Sharina Star. What's going on? Oh, 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 oh. Dang it. Oh, okay, so it said those two. All right, so we got the wish card. Okay, so it said just do it. So the wish card... So it says, your heart's desire is ready to come true. But it's weird because I heard breaking up. So it's like, this is really what you want to do. But I feel like somebody just didn't want to do it. So it looks like somebody just wanted to be with someone um, or just don't want to have another failed relationship. The thing is, is I could have 100 failed relationships. If I'm not happy, I don't care what nobody think. And a lot of people got to get like that. It's all about your self-happiness and and not what other people going to think or what people going to say. Um, and then that the stuff is in, in, what is it, instilled in us that, you know, that makes you a good or a bad person. No, it makes you a strong person because you can walk away from somebody that's doing dirty. Okay? That's just me. Yes. So we got the lion card here. So this is about being strong, you know, taking... Uh, taken up for yourself okay not just like falling into the social norms i gotta stay here because of xyz and move on because you not happy okay um so i said harness the loyalty and the protective aura of the lion and change uh and charge ahead uh magnificently okay so i do feel like strength more courage and i do feel like self-esteem will come to you once you leave this sorry situation okay so we got the judgment card here so that was out I, I was feeling like all the stuff that you was doing we got diary up there i don't want another name in my book okay and i understand that that that's fine but it's like do you want to stick around and be unhappy and be with somebody who stuck to somebody from before or do you want to go find that person that's for you okay so it says judgment soul searching will bring inner peace to many areas of your life, okay? So this makes me feel like um, there's going to be a time of isolation, time of by yourself after this relationship. Um, of course, people going to come, but at this time, you need to stay by yourself because you got that healing to do, okay? Um, but yet, yeah, somebody needs to find out what they need, what they want, what 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 suits them, what they can take. Somebody need to write down that list of their... Um, what do you call, I don't know, standards. And, and next time somebody come, if they, I mean, they got to at least have 75%, okay? You don't have to have 80 as long as it's lying and cheating ain't on that list, okay? All right, so we got the death. So a time of natural transition and transformation, okay? So definitely some changes coming through here. Um, so it's just on you to move forward and leave this toxic situation behind because it, it has become toxic. All right, look, bottom of the deck here. Um, as you're not fulfilled. You're not getting what you want when it comes to love. You're not getting what it, what you want when it comes to time, attention, and the passion is outside the house. So definitely, you know, it's just not working out for you here, okay? All right, so on the other side, look at this. Okay, so what are the odds that they were fall, like separate like that? 
So it says goals. Progress is, I mean, progress is positive and personal goals will be achieved. Okay. So it's like, I want to say rock out this situation, get out of here. Okay. And then start setting goals to make yourself happy. Okay. And then it says, Sons, oh, son, open your heart to enormous growth ahead, okay? So I do feel like you're going to grow physically, spiritually, mentally, and materialistically. I do feel like a lot of growth is on the way, um, but it comes with ending toxic situation and getting that strength and just judging situations more um, clearly when you first meet these people, okay? So it's just like, if it's a red flag, it's a red flag, run. You can find another one, okay? But other than that, that's all I have for you guys. Make sure to check your sun, moon, and rising signs. Thanks for watching.